last time on the thrilling adventures of Gabrush Threefwood, Mighty Pirate. I'm out of here. Hey there, Threefwood. Do you mind if I get your pirate on the street opinion about the Death Cloud? The Death, death Cloud? The Death Cloud. Pox of LeChuck. Aha. I am the Marquis de Singe. Somewhere in that easing appendage Did may lie the secret to life itself. It may? Hey, nice going, Han. Awesome. I'll know more after I cut it off. What? But hey, he likes what he likes. Stop. Let him have it. I must have your beautiful, justifying hand. Come back! Ah, slovenly parrots! Leaving their trash floating all over the place. Hmm. A parrot hunter, eh? Uh oh. Guybrush finally has control of his hand. But what can we make of this new villain, the Marquis de Sange? Stay tuned and find out more. Alrighty, now that my hand's under control, let's pop this bottle. Come on. Go! Yow! Elaine, here I come! And the map says... Or, um... Maybe not. What does the map say? Um, huh. Alright, we'll have to check that out later. I know one thing I'm gonna need. Come on. Run this way. Onto the ship. <coughs> Cheese wheel. Cheese wheel. Monster. Yeah. Still, maybe I'll find some starving rats who will eat it. Who would eat monster cheese? Come on. Come on. This way. And off. Are you? And away. Away, away. Boop -a -doop. Hi ho, tummy ho, tummy ho. Get your hand blown glass unicorns! Well, the one picture doesn't work. Let's talk to the voodoo lady, see if she knows a way to get it to work. Uh, let's see, the voodoo lady is. Let's see, that's buried treasure. Aha, the creepy shack. Where the voodoo lady is. And all the cloud is going to there. Wow, I'm traveling all over the place. What's this? A weather vane. Huh. Guess this thing fell off the roof when I had my little LeChuck episode. I should get shouty more often. <coughs> hmm. Looks yeah, like the wind gods of Flotsam are pointing that away. Let's see if she has anything to read the map. Why didn't you tell me that Grog could be used to stave off the effects of the pox? Grog? Grog won't cure the pox of LeChuck. It will only make it worse. How can Grog make anything worse? Your hand may seem fine now, but when it wakes up, it'll be even nastier than ever. You've just dun, got dun, a dun. thing against Grog. Uh, let's see. Alright, you can tell so me don't anything get up, about that. I'll find my own way out. Be well, Treepwood. Alrighty, let's see. Let's open up the locket, huh? Aww. Once I get off this stupid island and find Elaine, I guess I'm gonna have to track down this Decava guy so I can find La Esponja Grande. Let's ask her about it. No way I'm giving this away after all the trouble I went through to get it. But how am I supposed to ask her about it? Hand lotion. International um, House of Mojo brand hand lotion. Good for removing warts, curses, hexes, and unsightly buboes. Warning, not for use against poxes, especially the pox of LeChuck. Rats. Wow, very specific. <laughs> hmm. What's this? I recently found this contraption in a swamp. 
I have yet to plumb its mysteries. It doesn't do anything. Hmm. What's this? That is a shrine to Noah Treblig, <coughs> the keeper of the crossroads. Okay. Yeah, what's in the chest? <coughs> it's locked. Yes. And it will remain locked until it's ready to reveal its secrets many moons from now. But I want to know its secrets now. Wonder what's Don't in. Don't touch that. It's where I keep my unmentionables. Ugh. <laughs> frozen chicken gizzard, frozen newt eyes, stuff <coughs> and popsicles. But not what I need. Nothing bad needs here. Right. Come on, exit. Alright, obviously what I need is not here. Uh, da -da -da -da. Huh. Well, I know one thing that I'm gonna. No, not there. Tally ho! Back to ya. I know what would cheer up these gruesome carvings. Cheese! Cheese! Eh, nope. Still menacing. Oh, and now my cheese wheel is staring at me. Hey there! I'm Gilbert <coughs> Streetwood, mighty, mighty pirate. pirate. And you are? It's Hemlock. Hemlock McGee. Hey, you're the guy I'm supposed to be looking for. Couldn't leave old Hemlock alone with his grog and his tattered dreams, could they? Why aren't you in Club 41, curled up with your grog? The two-timing cannon cloggers kick me out! Why? The club has a strict no feet, no service clause. Seriously? Talk about adding insult to injury. That, that's just wrong. What happened to your legs? What the heck happened to your legs? You mean, <laughs> aside from some idiot <coughs> getting a poor old pirate involved in a deadly bar fight? <laughs> Um, sorry. Um, yeah. Sorry about that. Four words. The Marquis de Singe. 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 Whatever. The Marquis de Singe cut off your legs? Aye. Not only once, of course. He cut off the first leg seven years ago, after I stubbed me toe while investigating the winds of Hudson Island. That seems kind of severe. I sometimes I think that Ponzi Git has it <coughs> in for me. I think he has it in for everyone. I love everyone's legs. Did what can you tell me about the crazy wind? Aye. I've been trying to suss out these zany zephyrs since I <coughs> washed up here. And more I alliteration. I found an ancient scroll that promised to lead me to all the answers. No. I. But I couldn't figure it out. I got so frustrated that I kicked one of those statues out in the jungle and stubbed me toe. When I went to that butcher to charge, <coughs> he cut me leg off! Ooh, harsh. Without two good legs, I couldn't explore anymore. So I limped into Club 41 oh? and started up a long-term relationship with a keg of grog. Poor guy. Can I see your ancient scroll? Rain not, Skippy. Some two-bit witch stole it from me in a poker game a few months ago. Won't oh, do any good without my eye of the manatee, though. Eye of the manatee? Mm -hmm. Tell Can me I about it? 
Now, why in the name of Neptune's headmails would I let you borrow this priceless artifact of a long dead civilization? Because I asked nicely. Ah, my plus ten charisma. I'll go with because that. Because of my plus ten charisma. Uh, fine. Can't use it anymore. Wow, because... my charisma actually worked. <laughs> Yay. Thanks, Hemlock. I promise you probably won't regret this. Probably. Alright, so let's take a look at the map with this, eh? Oh, let's do that ancient scroll. This looks promising. Ooh, okay. Uh, wow, it's all over the place. Uh, looks like I start at the table. Follow, 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 follow. Where am I supposed to get a flower? Follow, 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 follow. A lot of following. Yeah, I'm supposed to go around. Uh, ish. Follow the wind. Follow the wind. Oh, there's the flower. Okay, never mind. Oh, I know where the flower is. Walking, 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 walking. <coughs> now I just gotta get to the table. Giddy up, giddy up. Ah, hey, that was easy. The table. I offer this scroll up to the altar in sacrifice. And I do a little jig. Alrighty, so let's see what I have to do first again. Offer up the scroll. B monkey wind. Okay. That's a monkey. Gotta go to a B. That's a bird. Gotta go to a B. This looks promising. B. Monkey. So far, so good. And... The wind tells me... Oh yeah, I need to do it in here. The wind tells me... I must go... Dead away. Hmm. Dead away. Okay. Dead away. And we go dead away. <coughs> Next, I offer up a flower to the well. Alright, and after that, what do I do again? Are those drawings supposed to represent the wind? Oh, well, follow the wind, follow B, follow the wind. Okay. God, I have a terrible memory. Mm, this looks After promising. well, it was wind, B, wind. Okay. So, alright. So, wind says go... Interesting. That way. Wind takes me this way. And B, I have to go back. Oh, I wasn't here before. And must follow the wind again. Wind says, dead away. I see. <laughs> yes, I see. This way, this way, this way. This looks promising. And then I have to go around you. And that sets that off. Where do I have to go around? Go after this. I have to go... Oh, the wind. Okay. And the wind takes me... Come on. The wind takes me... That away. Hmm. Tally -ho. Like the wind gods of Flotsam are pointing that away. Tally-ho, tally-ho, tally-ho. Ooh. Whoa. I am here. Uh oh. Someone's coming. <gasps> Who's coming? Who is here? It opens and. I never thought I'd have to come out here. It is the Marquis again. de Singe. But it'll be worth a temporary fluctuation in Flotsam's wind to get my hands on Sweetwood's uh, hand. <laughs> hands on his hand. <laughs> out troll. Out troll. Oh my god, I am so. So very about? knowledgeable. And what's behind that door? Hmm, don't know what's behind the door, but maybe we can get in. That looks like some of that unbreakable glass, that crystal. Uh oh. 
Looks like I cut off the door's nose despite its face. Poor door. I take your face. Sometimes it's all I can do to save a little face. I wonder if I can see anything on the other side. There's something interesting in there, but I can't tell what it is. You know it's interesting, you just don't know what it is. Oh, one thing I know. Gotta have the just had a really in there. weird idea. Ah, it's me! Driver's Street Boy. Why do you pirate? pirate? I've got a mission for you, little parrot. Go to the other side of this door and open it from the other side. Okay, little champion, open the door. Maybe not. Stupid bird. And yet there's still something downright charming about it. Alrighty. Anywho. Stay tuned and subscribe for more thrilling adventures with Dragon Twilight on Monkey Island.